first of all, I would like to emphasize that the car products are actually driven by the customer demands, right? Those requirements can be from the end customers or even can be created by the need new, you know, the car makers, right? So <laughs> we are um, facing a great opportunity of automotive industry, which can only have once in a century. So this industry is now transforming from the mecha mechatronics defined vehicles to the current stage of solar defined vehicles. Okay, so there are going to be a trillion dollar in the automobile industry uh, business market, you know, potentially. So the deep the integration of the big data, industry, internet, you know, information and communication technologies, you know, the artificial intelligence and other technologies, right, with the automobile industry has promoted the re redefinitions of the automobile in the functions, reconstruction of the industry in the structure, right, and also the innovation of new potential business models. So in the future, in addition to power internal, external design, and then mechanical performance, right? Those, you know, traditional properties of the car, the combination of communication, uh, computing, you know, storage, software, contents, personalization, and AI, you know, et cetera, will de determine the major difference of the vehicles. The vehicle will no longer be the transportation tools, we used to know and think about, right? You equate with the powerful perception systems, you know, continually running in actual power system, advanced automated driving systems, and a power computing platform, like human who has eyes, ears, heart, hands, feet, brain, right? So their vehicle has become an intelligent mobile robot with varied functions such as digital terminal, uh, even can be mobile data centers, right? Energy story unit, and the multi-function space, et cetera. So all of those, you know, new technologies have bring the significant change to the automotive industry. First, the continuous integration and development of industries will become the new normal. And the industry will seek more mutual cooperations and the mutual promotion. And the competition will further intensify. Second, the adjustment of the industry talent structure has brought about the large scale reshaping. And the talent competition and management have come in a new test. Third, changes in the product definitions, development mode, and the organization management styles are crucial, which require more agile development management mode and operation management for the whole life cycle of product developments, operations, service based on the user journey. So that's my uh, perspective in this area. Um, we really believe the not uh, intelligent and the network technologies combined with automated driving capabilities of the vehicle can significantly improve driving safety and comfort, uh, greatly reduce the number of traffic accidents and the casualties, and greatly improve the efficiency of the transportation and the logistics. Because high-level autonomous driving is a complex challenge with strong coupling between the people, vehicle, environment, and tasks. Compared with traditional vehicles, the driving um, subject is transferred from the driver to the autonomous driving system eventually. And the boundaries are more complex and changeable, which increases uncertainty in the process of product development and the usage. Uh, therefore, we continue to improve the intelligent safety of a single vehicle through the continued development and verification of complex environments through the perception of you know, future systems, in vehicle intelligent computing uh, in the platforms, 
uh, intelligent decision making and control systems, right? And uh, all of those, you know, the stuff. At the same time, we also consider use advanced communication technologies such as 4G, 5G, cellular, you know, V2X, edge computing, you know, to build the connection between the vehicle, the road, and the cloud, which they have the, you know, roadside perceptions and the positioning equipment, such as, you know, you can put the camera, radar, you know, you set those sensors in the, you know, infrastructure side to percept and then localize the road traffic in real time and the high precession level to help vehicle better, you know, resolve those long tail problems of single vehicle intelligent you know, facing right now, right? So um, to achieve the above, on the one hand, you know, we think the standardization organizations such as ITU need to be promote the continued improvement of the relevant communication standards and the safety, you know, standards as well, and support continually upgrade and the uh, evolution of the vehicle roads, uh, you know, coordination. Uh, in regarding to the data information systems, right? On the other hand, uh, governments really believe we recommend that you know need to strengthen top level infrastructure planning and the building for uh, you know better you know the roads for the intelligence connect vehicles. Yeah. Uh, Chan Automobile has already laid out and then right now is executing, you know, the strategy of transforming to a smart and a no carbon mobility technology um, company. OK, so which includes the acceleration of the additional of information, you know, communication technologies, upgrading manufacturing capabilities, transforming to intelligence, no carbon, and have to form a new automobile plus new ecosystem industry. That's what we call it. So the company comprehensively builds uh, new energy capabilities, ICT technologies, you know, digital and green ecosystems. As early as uh, 2017, Chang Automobile has successfully released the Shangri-La plan for new energy transfer uh, mission uh, strategy and the Beidou Tianshu plan for mobility intelligence. We actually established the one dedicated solar uh, technology company in 2019. In November uh, 2020, Chang'an released uh, we call MPA Fangzhou Architecture, which is the new intelligent platform cover A class to C class vehicles. In order to comprehensively uh, transform to electric intelligent connect and share the vehicles, uh, Chang Automobile began to build a smart vehicle super digital platform, uh, which is called SDA in May. Uh, 2021. SD is the super digital platform. This platform has four major features. First, the hardware uh, can be plug and play, and the resources are flexible and uh, you know schedulable. Second, um, service scenarios can be orchestrated through the SOA, you know, service oriented, you know, the, the architecture based service cross vehicle and cloud. The third, digital contents are provide on demand you know, from the end user side. First, the data-driven cost loop uh, is realized and the intelligence of vehicle service can be grown in the safety control environment. And the customer will find the, you know, their car become more and more intelligent. So for those four major features, um, we really, uh, you know, try hard to make SDA architecture, you know, work put into the, you know, real, uh, you know, the, the product development, uh, you know, effort and the resource. So if that works, uh, Chan Automobile will become, we really believe, uh, you know, world-class company, right? This is the Chan's goal, you know, it's my personal goal as well.
as the core participants of urban transportation, the how to connect vehicles with the intelligent transportation is more widely and efficiently to realize the integrate in the development is an important issue for future urban development. Autonomous driving and the intelligent you know, travel system not only connect many you know, high tech companies, but the more important provides a platform for interdisciplinary collaborations from communications, uh, road infrastructure, energy, internet, smart city management, big data applications, you know, information security, uh, network integration, you know, such as internet of transport, in internet of things, internet of uh, energy, right? Furthermore, it will connect uh, passenger flows, you know, the vehicle logistic and the information flow and realize interconnection of information with you know within the cities, uh, transportations, and uh, charge facilities, and form a new industry ecology. Right. So through this conference, we have the opportunity to put forward the problems and the source encounter in process of intelligent connected vehicles, and discuss with experts in various you know fields. We hope to call on the government to build friendly policies and the regulations for intelligent connect vehicles and this accelerate streams of industry to continuously improve relevant technical standards, you know, which will help to better promote the development of new automotive industry, right? So um, finally, I would uh, like to see that the Chang is actually the one uh, extremely open company. And uh, we define ourselves as the composite of the rule of equipment manufacturer, service provider, and even for future in the mobility platform provider. Um, we are willing to work with all partners uh, to build the full stack capabilities, such as hardware controller, you know, the electric and electronic architecture, you know, the, 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 the operating systems, cloud capabilities, and so on, right? With all of this capability in the super uh, digital, you know, so the platform we just call SDA, Chan will work with our partners to provide end users with sustainable digital products, right? And the continued operations, the value for better customer service experience through the whole, uh, you know, service cycle. Um, so um, finally, uh, thanks, ITO, for give Chan and me this chance to show our strategies and activities in the new intelligent uh, connect vehicle area. Thank you.